I, I think we've looked pretty good for a young team. I, you know, we're replacing a lot of guys, experienced players from last year, but the talent is there, the energy is there, the really competitive group. We're a work in progress right now, but we're, we're heading in the right direction pretty quickly. Well, we lost, we lost a solid amount of players and we, we gained a lot of freshmen. So it was really tough just like managing in the locker room because we have 14 freshmen coming in. But it was, it's really the environment in the locker room that has everyone going. Like the freshmen, they're all into it. They put their best foot forward in practice. And when, once everyone puts their best, best foot out in practice, I think in the games, we all come out and stuff on top of it. Gilbert's doing well. You know, Nick was injured his, his junior year and, and Gilbert came in and did a good job. And, and uh, he's a very mature keeper now. He's worked extremely, extremely hard. Uh, he's experienced. I don't think we'll, we'll miss a beat in goal. I've known it's my time for a while now. And seeing that Nick uh, did so well last season, um, it was great to be behind him all season last season because I learned so much from the way he just presented himself to the way he controls his entire box. I'm really looking forward to kind of making my own shoes next year, but at the same time, uh, Nick really did help me last year. Well, I mean, as, as I said with Kelvin, like Dominique Baggi, like uh, those are really, really big shoes to fill. I mean, we have Lucas McBride, we have Felix De Bona, who are, uh, are experienced strikers. And then we also have some freshmen coming in that actually look really good. Like in, in the preseason, they, they look solid. And everyone's putting their bust in their butt to do what they can do. We have two great strikers um, that have great experience up there already with Lucas McBride and Felix De Bona. But we also brought in uh, Anthony Viteri who's really been showing that he can uh, score on the offensive end and kind of get Lucas and Felix the ball when they need it. And uh, we're really excited in general. You know, it's, it's always competitive. You know, you open up with Fordham, who won the 8-10, and you got, you know, BC, who's always difficult for sure with the, you know, uh, with the ACC. So we just got to be prepared for, for that day. And, and, you know, I think the guys are getting ready for that. And uh, we'll worry about Fordham right now and, and see what we can do. I think a win at Fordham would be uh, Per, a perfect way to start the season. Now, uh, BC is in, our, in the back of our minds right now. Fordham is just a good team that we need to go into New York and really just handle well and let's get let's get the win. And one of the big things that we try to instill in the locker room is a, a kind of like a family attitude. And uh, I think everybody is really kind of taking that into consideration and kind of really using that to go forward. I think everybody is really kind of gelling into a family. I think these guys that some of the freshmen are already, I'm already really close with them, so it's been a really good uh, atmosphere in the locker room so far. I think we just need to stay together. I think we need to work as a team, just have everything going as a system. We can't be playing individually. That's like the, the biggest thing that we're trying to get, we're trying to get everything cohesive from the back to the midfield to the forwards and with the goalies, just everyone talking to each other, keep positive and um, just put in the tactics to work.